you, man. Fuck your content, bro. I'm sick of it. What's up, brother? Wait, right? you knew we were coming to BB Bob? Of course I did. This guy's sucking for content, bro. Look it up. I think our recipe would be good if Tyler will just tell us what he wants us to do. If Tyler tells us what he wants us to do, we'll win. Just play around that little bit. I agree. You got four. How's your food, Tyler? How you doing, little man? I think Stanley, like, honestly, Cap put me on. I had to get the same thing he got because last time I tried it, it was trash. Oh, yeah. I hate beans. I hate Wait, beans too. What Wait, I hate beans too. <laughs> no, I hate beans too. That's why I don't fucking I wanted to try it to see if the beans, like, maybe I liked them, but I didn't like them. <laughs> Just haven't had beans in, like, forever when I tried it. So, getting lost with the kids. <laughs> I lost Tyler with the little kids. <laughs> I, <laughs> I thought that's, he was a kid. That's literally what I said. I, <laughs> I, I, lost lost I got lost with the kids. <laughs> After the second place finish in Vegas, I felt really confident in the team. We played really well, and the only two bad matches we had was against Optic, but I was ready to get back home after that and grind with the team. Dum Dum, give me gum gum. <laughs> When we went to the Pro League, I felt really good about the team because we honestly started getting back into the groove of things about two weeks ago and started playing really well in scrims again. But there was a time period before that where we just weren't playing well, and I'm definitely glad that we finally got back up to the potential that I thought we should be at. Okay. Holy shit. We're living in the future, bro. Vans scare me, bro. I don't know, I like, I always go to close the door and that happens, I'm like, oh, I'm an idiot. Is oh, it my picture, man? Yeah. <laughs> 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 right. right there. <laughs> Wait, I have one thing. Wait, I have WT. Go home and start grinding. Like, immediately, I, like, as soon as we're done with our match on Thursday, go home and all start scrimming. I don't like, get it, though, because on Tuesday, no, we could do, we could play here, can't we, until Friday? No, the, all these all these are gonna be on the old patch until after Thursday. Yeah, so but we Friday, can get here on Friday. On like, Friday, yeah. yeah. But Thursday night, we're gonna have to go and start scrimming on the new patch and getting used to that. And we're gonna have three days, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, Monday, four days to prepare for fucking three matches. It's gonna be annoying matches. though, because when we get home, we're gonna have to play on the new patch, come back, or not home, but like to our apartments. We can't even play COD. We can't even play COD, no. Yeah. After, well, after today, play. after today, we shouldn't play anything on the new patch because it's going to fuck your shot up. Because, like, the Maddox and Saw are going to be severely nerfed, and it's going to fuck your timings up. It's going to fuck everything up. The only way we can practice is if we come here and play in the old patch. That is trash. <laughs> I, I can't really do that. Sure. It looks weird. We're good. What if you had, like, um, a little guy laugh. No, that's a good idea. <laughs> well, you had to walk <laughs> away and take a breather. <laughs> I had him laugh yeah. for too long. Yeah. I should bring a jersey every time you take this one. What's your winner shot? You're gonna do the Alex? You're the Nick Proto. Thanks, man. Good luck. What's up, dude? What's good, brother? Why are you getting some content right now? How are you doing? You show up, I gotta get good content. Yeah, bro, I can't believe they didn't wake me up from my nap. I'm a little pissed off. They got food without me, so I had to go do a show on my own. A little piata? Yeah, I mean, I had to get my avocado wrap. Where's Burns, bro? I don't give a fuck where Burns is. He doesn't need to show up for a while. I'm about to play a man's game. I don't know, bro. You probably be playing that fucking metal. Uh, nah, I never, I never had the ox cable, dude. It was always Nate shot. He would never give it. He would never give it to me, dude. He probably played the bangers. He did play the bangers. Some of the speed bumps we hit during practice is we were just like not playing well as a team and we just got into a lot of arguments. We're losing full like all the time. And thankfully, after that happening for about two or three weeks, we finally just got together as a team and we're just like, we gotta stop losing full. We just gotta start like playing better as a team and stop getting into so many arguments over and over. Yeah, just, just remember, yo, this is fucking, these first couple of matches are gonna be the hardest, but they're also gonna be the most important. So like, no getting pissed at each other, none of the exasperation bullshit, just believe in each other, fucking play with each other, communicate, do all the right shit, man. Don't let them get on their rhythm and don't get fucking discouraged. That's all we gotta do. We know we're better than these kids. 
It's going to be a big night. We've got United versus, of course, the mighty, passionate heretics. Phil, how are you feeling? Uh, I'm feeling nearly as excited as me, but if you guys can hear him, he sounds like he's uh, ready for the game, ready to kick off Division B, and uh, I most certainly am too. Watch the showers, the showers, or the clouds. I'll get time, I'll get time. I'll get time. I'll get time. You got me right, I'm not right. I'm right. It's shower, shower, shower. I gave the pinch, I gave the pinch. Yo, yeah, two this, two this. Two this, two this. Two this, two this. Two and oh, 3-0, 3-0, they're pushing out, they're pushing out, they're pushing out. Backing off here, looking to attack, looking to retake here on their own. We're jumping up from the middle, we're gonna see two go down. And a beautiful shot here, we'll find Clayster and Jacob pull off the two v four, I believe there it was. Journey finds the first, it's all up to him, it's a one v four, he's tagging them all up, but Abizi finalizes the round, finalizes the game, five to seven. The time is ticking, someone needs to make the play. The trades go down, it's going down in post as well. Methods and Metal, they're actually gonna pick up a couple of kills themselves. The War Machine's out and this one's Metal. Sucre's going off, Methods is going big. The kill feed lighting on Blue and Heretics. They're gonna level it out. It's gonna be three to three, but the important thing here is the zone's going down, the War Machine is available. Do they have Black Jacket? Absolutely not, and Heretics. They're the ones that clutch up. I mean, yeah, we should have won that map, but there's nothing we can do about it now. He's got yeah, to play relaxed and relax and spend this next one. They're going to be coming out super fucking fast. Like, they have so much adrenaline in like, that map. So he's going to slow the fuck down and just kill them and they're just spraying at us. It's all good. I'm putting one on gun. I'm putting one on gun. Don't push gun. Don't push gun. Let's wind it right here. Prestini goes big. Very well used. It might only be the first, but what he does do is stay alive by the hard point. Can rotate back. Can trade out. This is what he wanted to be able to do, and he's got to be able to do just that. Metals has called in the drone squad and hit the deck for seniors. That is uh, not what you like to see. I believe a Tempest is out. Well, oh, that's going to be it. He united. They come back in dominating fashion here. In I feel like the uh, guys came out a little slow versus Heretics. Um, could tell we were playing a little unorganized and taking challenges that we shouldn't have. I feel like we're slowly getting back into the series and how we normally play. Um, they played absolutely fantastic on that hard point, and now we just need them to clutch up uh, on the game five. Can't find Clay. The battle's still going down. Still. Oh, journey goes. It's a great round. Next kill is crucial. Lightning Strike technically could be invested here. Everyone's going to be pretty much outside, but he's looking for that first kill. Bates out with the ICR. I like the interchange of the weapon there. Prestini comes out on top, and oh, he's not going to get anything more. And kicking now, the bomb is down though. Four to five. Both in round and lives here as it gets a little bit too intense. 35 seconds remain on the clock. Sliding back into the grass slams available. Prestini needs to invest this, but no, goes down. And Heretics can end it right here. All five alive. Four to one. Clayster has to get a 1v5 to win the series. Look, he's going to slide away, sending the troops, and Heretics come out on top. No! You gotta crawl from the right side and you can plant it behind the brick wall. We gotta have Preston playing like the front so he can't push up on me. I didn't know everyone gave up on me. I was sitting on the fence line and people just, he just slid on me. You don't get wall banged up Bob probably run that round. Yeah, no. Literally, I know. It's just so annoying about it. Should've told you. I gotta go find... Fuck me, man. Fuck me. Came out slow game one. I mean, we could have definitely took that map, but we just had a really rough start. I mean, we threw away the game three, which was a big swing map. And I mean, we had we had moments in the game four where we could have brought that back, but we just didn't close it out. Just a few small things. We just had small mistakes in control that cost us the last round. We definitely should have won. We were in in an 8v5 and just didn't get a single kill. And they just literally traded us out better than, didn't even trade us out, they just got every single kill. We lost because of it, so. And if we would've won that, we'd've won the series 3-1, so. Honestly, it all came down to that control. After the Heretics loss, we went out to dinner and just talked about some of the things we did wrong. Honestly, we kind of came into the match rusty, so we knew the next day that we could easily regain and get a W. Beautiful, beautiful, I got a great feeling about tomorrow. Great. Hey, you're oh shit! It's <laughs> the star of the show, baby. Young Abizi. It's 
just like, we don't really need to play that smart. We just need to gun the other people, like, you know, and break the hill and then hold. They're, it's not even that they're faster than us, it's that like, they keep singling us out in the gunfights with two people. And we always like, can't get away, or if we do get away, we use our stem and we can't immediately re-engage. This ain't the order, bro. Get on your side, cuz. Oh, another one in the right lobby, right lobby ICR. Right lobby ICR, another one, not him. I started playing COD when I was about eight years old when it was COD 4, and I had a passion for it after that, and I just grinded every single COD. And then up at about AW, I started playing S&D tournaments, and that's when I realized I really wanted to play COD competitively. About to go up against E6. Uh, we lost yesterday against Heretic, so this is a really big bounce back match for us. Um, I mean, I'm no stranger to starting off poorly in the Pro League, but nobody really wants to repeat what happened last year, uh, starting off like two and six. Got a little bit more leeway here, but we're not going to really focus on that. We just need to focus on winning these matches, get some wins on the board, because next week we're playing a brand new game. So, got to get some wins on the board while we're still practicing what we've been practicing the past four months. Solid, solid numbers from Clayster and Arsties is putting this game to bed. And it's this man right here, still going strong here. Multiple kill streaks, multiple score streaks. And oh. Frosty, get out of there! The ICR is this man's and this man's only at this standard time. A United take map one. Oh, you go, boys. Go. Yo, shit, SMG is back. Let's see what he can do with the SMG. Oh no. Oh my goodness, trying to go for the quick snipe. He's got a concussion. It might be too late though. No, oh, he's got a concussion. Oh, get, get, get off me! That's the time to get up and start shouting. Players on top of the platform, players on the outside. What's up next? Can Arsys find anything? One. And they're second. And oh! oh! Let's go, Alex. That's what we like to see with the Annihilator, baby. That's what we like to see, Alex. Oh, you said you were gonna snipe. Yeah, I know. It's not the whole game. Every single not the whole round. Game. <laughs> I know. I've got streaks. I got streaks off both annihilators. Maybe looking to push on to A, but the United still with great position and still with kill after kill. 27 seconds here. Is Enigma 6 gonna find anything with that tag 5 boost? Perfectly implemented. 10 seconds left on the clock as E United have slammed the door in the face of E6. They didn't even let them touch the point. No one has been able to get in there yet, and at this point, no one will. Clay Z on point. Pristini as well. The shots are through. It's a complete shutout. How does it feel to bounce back with a clean 3 0 after yesterday? Feels really good. I mean, um, especially this being Enigma 6, which is a BZ's old team. So, like, for him to, to come out here the first time he plays them to 3 0, I'm sure that felt good for him. But also for all of us, I mean, Heretics is, is on fire right now. They're really, really talented. And so, losing. I think I played pretty well. Honestly, didn't have to do much first map because Alec just took over. But played pretty well the rest of the series or the second and third map. Yeah, I think we played that really like calm and collective. It was a really good win. We needed that. All right, Tyler, what's the, what's the guy? He said there's an off. Chicken you, there's chicken that's not on the menu that you have to order, and it's Why? the best chicken ever. Why are we listening to a 12 year old? It's a secret. It's a secret. Like a J. Alexander secret. Cheers, cheers, everybody. It's a kid's meal. Wait, cat. I hate my life, bro. Yeah, yeah, you know, that's a cheese, bro. Where's the top? Oh, it's just. <laughs> I just saw so much. Did you get that on film? You're an idiot. It looked like No, he thought the cheese was the top. The cheese looked like the bun. That's how thick the cheese is. I was like, what? You're right. No, I'm not good, bro. Apparently not. playing fastball, and you know what that means. Literally the most aggressive player in the world. So, yeah, literally one speed, never stops running. So, I mean, I mean, they're pretty aggressive. I don't think they're nearly as aggressive as Heretics. So, as long as we just like play our game, we should be able to win. So as long as we just play our game, this should be a series that we should take every single time. Rafizi, oh boy. Man down, we gotta, oh, I gotta drink down. Oh no, I just dropped the whole game. It's we're, everywhere. We're gonna need some help back it's, here. Oh, David is, 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 has lost it all. I'm gonna drink what's left, y'all. You are a mess. I'm a child. Yes, you are. <laughs> all over the floor, hoping, hoping to get any on, on any of the electronics. But we'll hop to Clayster's POV, sog in hand as he's looking for M. Ruiz. He knows he's there. He's like, you're gonna peek. 
Finally, the push comes. He's ready and waiting. The patience from Clayster pays dividends. It's a matter of time now before EU United get map one of the board. And in five more seconds. I don't know if he's going to hit that. Well, never mind. He is able to get one off, and, but that's fallen five dead. So that should be game number one for you. Then. Fucking go! Let's get busy, baby! He's got to get one kill. He's going to fly on in. He does find one. Oh, God, Cap! Oh, and a little bit of extra love. Arsenis. Oh, can they get to round five? There's only two players left. One player now left in a BZ. He's backed up the tank. And now this becomes all but impossible for the youngster. Well, United, they have dropped two maps in a row on the brink of dropping this best of five. They've got to get it going. They got to bring the passion. Let's get to an Astro Gaming listening with the United. They're going to do that bake strat, yo. Yeah, whoever's pals, back up. Where's pals back up? All right, all right, you sure? All right. I'm just sitting outside bake right now. He could kill you. He could kill you. I'm sitting outside bake right now. Top trip. He's in bake. He's in bake. He's in bake. Jump up on him. He's in bake. Jump up. 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 Jump out of the back, out of the back. I'm pressing 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 He's got to bring it back, give it a final one. Can they snap on it? But he's able to stay up. The plant goes through. He ends up dropping. Arsenis no, can't get away from the drone squad. squad. They have to deal with the drone squad. He's already give got one. one. Good luck, BZ. Good luck, BZ. He's got ICR. He's got to deal with it. He's got time. He has time, but he has to deal with his drone squad. He's able to find one, two more to deal with now. One versus two, Clint. This is the most intense situation I've ever all. seen. It's like Terminator. He's got, no He's got no ammo. He's got to switch to the pistol. Shoot the, shoot this drone squad. Shoot this. Going for it. He's going for it. Shoot. Make that drone squad blind. Doesn't matter. He gets it in. <laughs> that was fun. A BZ on the flank, able to win the one v one against Bali. Finds a second on the BZ. And now, now if you're the defense. You're just scrambling here for the hold up. BZ has torn you apart. Christine is on it. Christine Almost there. Still on it. Almost there. BZ, believe he gets the kills inside the down to a 1v1. J Cap first. BZ, exactly what I asked for. Lightning strike in. Lightning strike in and Cap wins. Let's go! Let's go! Let's go! Let's go! What kind of thoughts were going through your head, particularly in the last moments of that SD? So I was just hoping that we'd win because they're shooting my body and I know their ass, so I was just hoping we'd win and not lose to them. Oof. Jesus Christ. Holy fuck. They capped with the ice. No, I, I angled it. I'm a good defuser. Scary, Don't worry about me. Just not a good planner. So you said you downed the kid outer? I, I thought you were still gonna look there. Or you, I thought you said or something. So I was holding in her, like I'm still in her, and then he, that's why I got the time to shoot. I literally it. say, it's like map four. I literally say, I hope it comes down to a game five round 11 between Cap and Beasy for Beasy shooting your body map two, and it actually fucking happened. Wait, really? Yeah, it actually, I mean, we just clutched up. It was actually surprising. I was actually kind of heated because the last round I got my lightning. As soon as I got my lightning, I got traded. So I was like, shit. Like, and then next thing you know, Caps in a 1v1 and just clutches it. Thank God we clutched up game five because that was just so stressful. It's like the most stressful game five ever. Have you ever shaved? So. Have you shaved before? Yeah, yeah I shaved before. Yeah. <laughs> wow, I'm serious. I'm he just takes Razor once. <laughs> 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 Alright, get back to work. I would go man. Alright, cool. There it goes. The Originally, the plan thing. was to plan the old patch oh, with the yeah. God Medics for only the first week. And then they decided that to keep the league consistent, all the matches consistent, we're going to plan on the old patch for both weeks we're here. Which. I think most players are not going to have that. I'm not going to have that because it kind of puts us at a disadvantage with Fort Worth. Give us less practice, so. I don't know. I see both sides, but I think it kind of sucks. Hey. 
was actually coming to you to get this to you and you're walking away from me. What's going on? You want it or not? About to play Hunter T. I mean, it's very important because it's 3-1. It, it all goes for a forward, so we're just going to try to finish it strong, play our best, and hopefully prove that we, we got second in Vegas still. Because people forgot. People forgot I, I went off at Vegas. They're like, oh my god, he's still good. Who would have thought? Who would have thought? Still one more game to come for today's action. And boy, oh boy, is this going to be a good one. E United versus the Thieves, a.k.a. 100 Thieves, if you want to be precise with it. Uh, I, this is going to be probably the best game of the day, probably the closest game. This is the time where we can like try to put 100 Thieves on the level. Is, but here we go in the game one and Priest uh, and Kenny find a couple of kills and Abel finds one on our cities and J-Cap that means all dead for E United a great start for 100 Thieves they try to send a couple of players to the back doesn't work J-Cap Pristini here they're the last couple of players they're gonna get shut down in Octane Slasher looking for an opening pick there about but he can't find our he's they able to go. get saved he gotta go this is the last effort this is the last effort Pristini gets a couple Abizi still has that war machine on E United. Nice shot. The war machine. This might not even matter because Enable goes down on the other side of the map. It doesn't matter. He's just going to run away. Great job by Abizi. He's able to connect with one, but doesn't know Slasher's there. Slasher now trying to stay up. 3v4 has the help of Octane. He gets the war machine. It's a two versus two. But it's Pristini all the way through the back of their base. He's tagged up. Twins working together and E United didn't take Let's go, baby. Good job. Let's go. Good shit. Yo, what's the fucking press when we said something, all right, guys? Everyone stop. Like, let press make the play. 6v5 now. Pristini. Here comes the push. Octane's going to fall, but not before, or not until after he gets two kills. Pristini's just flying. Just kind of throws his life away as they're playing in the back. It's all on a BZ, a BZ kick. Get it done. This is not over yet. United are locking it down right now. Trades back and forth. Oh my god. And they're still spawning in the back so they can have this oh rally, but there's the Tempest. He gets up for a second, so has to knock him back down again, but they're in. There's the points. And 100 Thieves get the hard point victory. Just barely able to do it, but good stuff from Clay to stay up. They push window. J Cap is here. And J Cap makes the play. Kenny, though, able to find one. Now a one versus one. Cap again. Has the stun, and that's a full stun. stun. Kenny should have it. Kenny up. should have it. What a clutch from Kenny there. It got scary for 100 Thieves, but he goes massive. Not only do you win the round, you stop J Cap, who's getting close to streaks. Big play there from Kenny. He does get traded, though. Priest to come soaring over the top. 4v3 now for 100 Thieves. United have to try and make this retake happen as they're getting picked apart. Abizi doing his best to make it interesting. He got through, though. Abizi got through. This could get interesting. 15 seconds left now. Just play time. Play time. Just run away. Play the time. Play the time. 10 seconds left. He's got to win the first gunfight. He's got to win the first gunfight. He does it. Wait, wait, wait. Unbelievable. That was an insane series. You kind of saw it on your face, but can you tell me how, what was going through your head during those last moments of that last SMD? Um, so we were telling Cap, we didn't notice Cap was two off streaks, and um, we noticed that we, he was, and we were like, just play for streaks, two before, no way we win this round. We're going game five, I, or round 11. I, I have grab spikes, and he's going to be one off streaks. He gets a kill. We're good. Um, and then Tyler, they go back to get uh, Cap a kill, so he get closer, and he ends up killing all four, and we're like, what the hell? And Clay even said not to hop the bomb when Tyler got all those kills, and Cap was like, screw it, I don't care about the streaks, I'm hopping it. And he, it worked out because Tyler got the last kid too. I, I am, I'm mind blown right now. That's all I have to say, really. Tyler's been amazing this week, man. He's just been phenomenal, especially in Search and Destroy. That's like one of the main reasons we picked him up is to be a Search and Destroy specialist. And not only has he been performing in Search and Destroy, he's been performing in Respawn as well, so it's really good to see. It, it's, not, it's not anything, you know, like to be really too happy about. Obviously I'm happy with the win, but in the end it's like we gotta play better if we wanna win the playoffs.